So this auction is for September 10th at 9.30 here at the Narragate Event Center, which is 2206 Old St. Mary's Pike, Parkersburg, West Virginia. We've been commissioned to sell a group of tools and equipment. We got the contents of his shop and his yard. And so if we can look right here, you can see a, a, a table saw with square and an extender table. Right behind that, there is a metal saw, okay? This right here is a neat piece. This is a stand grinder, okay? Right here we have a lathe. Now, on our warm-up table, we have this gigantic rigid pipe wrench. Um, that's easily a $200 bill if you go buy that. Um, we also have some Bostitch tools. And then if we go back across here, as you can see, we have steel and Husqvarna chainsaws. We have DeWalt tools and Makita tools. I thought this was particularly interesting. There's a set of wood chisels. So if you're into woodworking, we've got those, okay? This is a neat item right here. This is a DeWalt chop saw, sliding chop saw. Very nice. We have several um, of these air guns. We have this transit, okay? So those are used to drive nails with, as are these. We've got this Delta um, grinder. We have this DeWalt tool right here. This is a neat piece and it was very heavy. This is a shop table with a large vise. Those are hard to come by, okay? A small DeWalt planer. Now, a lot of these things come with documents for when they bought them. Here we have a DeWalt um, table saw, racks that go inside of a van for tool van, um, a really cool cobalt toolbox. This is a tree stand, kind of neat. And then we have these six chairs right here as well. Hand tools and carpentry tools. We've got um, mechanics tools, of course. Now over here on this side of the house, there's some neat stuff that you could use in a lot of operations. There's a large fan. These are cutting torches, small and big. We have that Delta saw. We have an air compressor, this drill press. Right here, is a small uh, Lincoln welder, which is really neat. We have a small metal chop saw and this champion generator, okay? Now, as we get back into the back corner here, um, you're looking at tons of hardware, okay? Nuts, bolts, all kinds of fittings, um, some mixed in tools and hand tools and such, but again, if you're setting up a shop or you have a shop and you need to add to it, right here, save you a ton of money, come here and buy it here. Okay, so what we have here is a Powermatic uh, industrial wood planer. Um, it's electric powered and definitely if you're looking to plane a lot of, of lumber, this would be the thing to have. Next up in line, we have this case wheeled backhoe, okay, um, started right up when we loaded it and did a great job uh, running on and off the trailer. If you need to dig ditches, this is the thing you can do it with. Now, next to this is kind of a cool piece. This is a Caterpillar 931B crawler. Um, And it certainly is in good condition. Started right up, ran like a top. It's got the multiple bucket on. It's also set up to run these forks with. And as you can see, the undercarriage is not bad at all on this machine. And it's been well maintained. So 931B crawler loader. 
So again, for our Saturday the 10th auction, we have this John Deere L110 automatic uh, lawnmower with accompanying uh, cart. We have a zero turn MZ Magnum bad boy mower, very cool. We have this Honda 250 four wheeler, four tracks. Right here is a go-kart. Go-kart needs a belt, but and other than that, it's in great condition. We go across the way. We have this brush hog we'll sell separately from the tractor. And this is a Belarus full-wheel drive uh, farm tractor, model 572. It's got the loader on the front, diesel powered. Um, definitely runs out good and it'll be in the sale. Now some of these units have reserves, some do not. They all sell as is, where is, at auction.